Hello, I'm Miss Carrie from FEMC Rogers, located in historical downtown Rogers, Arkansas. And I'm so glad you're here with me today. We are beginning a new series called What is God's Love? It's a mini splendid thing. Now our first week here is talking about how love builds up. And it comes from 1 Corinthians chapter 8 verses 1 through 13. Because of the intensity of the scripture, I have chosen not to read it this week. But there are some great points that I, I want to share with you. One, it talks about how when we are full of knowledge that we kind of get prideful. We start to boast. We start to brag about what we know and what we uh, can do and what our skills are. And when we're in a puffed up mode or prideful or boastful mode, we tend to tear other people down. Maybe not intentionally, but if we're saying that we're the best at something, that could lead someone else to feel less confident, less assured, less loved. And God's love builds us up. And being boastful and prideful is not something that builds us up. It actually tears us down. It also continues to talk about how there's one God for all of us which to me is a very reassuring thing that God loves each and every one of us. And as much as he loves each and every one of us, none of us are more special than someone else. So whether they're following the same God as us or following an idol or not following any God at all, they are still precious to him. He still loves them and he's still trying, trying to find ways to build them up so they know him. And it's also talking about how we as true believers, as followers, need to be mindful of how we do things. Because someone that might not have the faith that we do or the love for God as we do, might see some of our actions and recreate them and misunderstand them. For instance, you know, how many of you have ever done something and your little brother or your little sister or a cousin mimicked you? You knew that it probably wasn't the best choice, but you did it, maybe to be silly, Maybe because you were upset, um, whatever your reasoning, they followed suit. They mimicked you. They copied you. They are learning from you. Just like other people are learning from us. So if, as Christians, we tell a lie, they're going to say, oh, it's okay to lie if I'm a Christian. If we're not kind to someone, it's easy for them to say, oh, it's okay not to be kind if I'm a Christian. Um, whether it's gossiping or being disrespectful to our parents, they see us as examples. And if we're not setting a good example, they're going to learn the bad example. And that's not what God's wanting. God's wanting to build each of us up in love. And that is part of our responsibility as followers in the faith. We know God's love. And it's we need to be sharing God's love to build others up, to help their faith grow. So they know the one true God. And we have to be mindful and be careful of our actions and our choices because sometimes someone else is watching and they're going to think it's okay to do that. 
whether it's a little brother or a little sister, or whether it's someone that doesn't know God's love yet. So, act kindly. Think before you react. And share love to build others up. All right, let's go ahead and bow our heads in prayer for this for today. Dear God, thank you for your love that builds us up. Builds us up so we can share your love with others. Help us be mindful and make the right choices and set good examples for those that do not know you the way we do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right. Until we see each other again, many blessings.